Lieutenant Colonel Ojede Adolf and Warrant Officer Bakari Felix, both retired, are part of the Nigerian soldiers who fought the Nigerian Civil War to keep Nigeria as an indivisible entity but sustained injuries which led to the amputation of their arms. They are happy to be part of this year's appeal fund. I feel good because I'm alive. I'm talking because of many of my colleagues, they have all gone. My take to government is that they should continue to help us as we are disabled. It's commendable. He has opened a very good chapter and we all should be praying we should have the best government. Governor Baseki describes their sacrifices to the nation as worthy of note. The governor who announced the donation of a Hilux van to the legioners urged well-meaning individuals to contribute to the well-being of the veterans who are still alive and the families of the departed. This annual celebration creates an opportunity for us to appreciate the services of our gallant heroes who paid the supreme price of sacrifice to ensure that peace and stability reigns in our country and in other parts of the world. On this occasion, therefore, I would like to salute the men and women of our armed forces for the various roles they are playing to ensure the survival of our country's unity despite the current challenges of terrorism, banditry, and insurgency in some parts of the country. This year's Armed Forces Remembrance Day will be rounded up this Wednesday with a military parade and laying of wreaths. In Benin, good luck in any NT News.